good morning everybody since i woke up i just uh fed v and tiger tiger is eating now she's no longer drinking v's milk she is just eating so but v eats her food and like i'm so upset about that v stop that's tiger food. Thank you. I have to keep telling her. Look at them. I feed both of their plates and then Mani finishes and then she goes to Tiger's. Like, girl. Look. Yeah, whatever. So, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to do at this point. Do I take the food out? Because she is traveling. Poor baby. He don't eat that much either, I don't think. Yeah, I'm just gonna save the food with a couple more minutes and if he eats it, then I mean she if she eats some more then it'll stay. But what I'm gonna do now is well today we have a lot of things to do, a lot of errands to run, so what I'm gonna do is I am going to V, that's it. That's it. That's it. You already ate a lot, baby girl. <laughs> I get that you're the mom and everything, but you're not a uh, like you're not feeding tiger no more. Cause one thing that I learned about um, nursing moms is that yeah, they need a lot of protein. They need a lot of this, a lot of that. But like. You're not nursing no more. Tiger's already her own girly. So, <laughs> I will not let you eat Tiger's food. Like, you already ate your food. So, we will not eat Tiger's food. And then the funny thing is, like, I got this for Tiger. Hi, Tiger. Hi, baby. Ooh, 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 ooh. That didn't work out well. <laughs> so, yeah, like I was saying, I tried to give her this because it says kitties, kittens. It's like, okay, yeah, natural food for kitten with added vitamins, minerals, and other nutrients. Baby girl, because mind you, this is like the second time, well, the really first time that I'm having cats on my own. I used to have cats, a cat when I was younger and I don't even remember the color of it it's been so long like and it died and you know a bunch of stuff but this is the very first time that I'm doing it on my own and so obviously I've done a lot of research I've done a lot of you know like looking and digging to understand a cat and I've seen documentaries and I've seen you know all kinds of movies and stuff so you know and then when i go to the store it's just amazing because i go to the cat aisle and it's like i'm paradised because i want to get them stuff so bad like i want to get them everything that they need because i love them <laughs> i am not okay anyways so i got <laughs> i got uh, this but she wouldn't eat it at first but v could v is a mommy and tiger's a baby we're friends so V could, so I was like, uh uh, I didn't get this for V. I get V the Meow Mix brand because the reason why I do it is because it has chicken, turkey, salmon, and ocean fish. Okay. This is the brand that I get her Meow Mix, yes. Uh, it has high quality protein, uh, taste of outdoor greens. And this is the stuff that I just mentioned. The reason why is because I want V to have a, a healthy, you know, diverse type of meal. I want her to get all of, you know, everything. Not just chicken every day, not just fish every day. I just wanted to give her like a variety of things to eat. So it's exciting. And then I also got the wet food from the same, the same, um, brand and it comes with 
12 little foodie things and I put one in Tiger's food. I didn't know she wasn't gonna eat everything. So I'm gonna save it for later. Uh, but I gave I gave the uh, I gave the whole one so yeah she tore that up and this is what the <laughs> dry food looks like it's colorful it's cute so and guys this is a life hack that I just started to do um, because you hear about um, food cross contamination and stuff so if you have a cat or a dog and this happens use this and boom she would not eat this one so what i did start to do is i started to mix it with um dry food and then she will eat it so i'm happy about that Okay, let me just, because she didn't eat um, her dry food, so I'm, I'm going to put it back, okay? I'm going to put it back. We save over here. We save. So, oh, by the way, this is what we're looking like. I'm gonna wash my hair right now. I'm gonna take I'm about to take a shower and wash my hair. But this is what we looking like. Oh I know you see that. I know you see that. I don't know how to call these type of braids. Hey, hold on, let me go in the light. <laughs> so y'all can see better. Do y'all see better? <laughs> hold on. Okay. Of, um, living conditions, so I'm glad that it dried. It just kind of left. I don't know what these braids are called, but I just know that <laughs> this was one of my go tos during uh, high school. Yeah, but I just did this because, uh, yeah, I took my braids out, my single braids out, and I was not trying to have my hair in a puff. I wanted you know some moisture but I wanted in a puff today so I'm gonna wash my hair and then I'm going to do a puff and that's it <gasps> all right I keep thinking of this I'm trying to see what we up to she's right there one thing about my baby is whenever I'm in the kitchen if I'm cooking or yep 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 I'm in the kitchen like she will come and she will Keep me company.
really liberal, so really good days. I like me a good reality show. I've watched so many of them. Love is Blind, Too Hot to Handle, The Ultimatum. You name it, like just a bunch of black love. And then I saw one that was called Love After Jail or something. So it's basically like people were falling in love. A person from jail would fall in love with a person from the outside and they would send letters and stuff, blah, blah. And then until the day that the person that was in jail came out, they would get together and they, child, it was just too much. Stuff changes when your environment changes sometimes. I like to watch them baking cooking shows. I haven't seen Love Island. I started watching a little bit, but I was like, I don't know, it's not it. watched the one where the girlies go to somebody's house usually like a, a celebrity and they organize their houses that's really 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 nice to watch and then how they you know i've seen glow up oh is there another season because i loved glow up okay i love 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 I think it's season five. Hold on. Yeah, I did. I saw the seasons. They are good. Like, everybody just so talented. I saw Bake Squad. The Mole is amazing. The Mole is basically like people, they're in missions. And I don't know if I'm explaining this well, but they're like in the wilderness. They're like in the jungle or, I don't know, sometimes they they just have different missions to accomplish and then they need to find out who is the imposter like who's the person that's trying to put them to set them back it was really fun to watch i feel like surviving paradise might be kind of the same vibe i don't know love after divorce I saw a little bit of Minding Your Manners. That was really nice. Uh, for example, when you have tea, you're not supposed to, like some of us, when we put sugar in the tea, we go around in the, in the cup. You're not supposed to go around. You're supposed to go like this. And she was teaching how to sit and how to um, even cut bread and eat it, like, or how to drink soup or how to, you know, it's just a lot of stuff that sometimes I'm like, well, I'm going to just be me and, you know. But it is interesting to watch. How to get rich. I haven't seen how to get rich. Whether you're living to take your paycheck or have a trust fund money, expert Ramit Sethi shows you how to live the richest life your budget allows. I think just in general, when you're in, in your 20s, you, you definitely need some kind of guidance hey guys so basically i did all that i had to do and then i went to the post office um and i mailed the stuff that i needed to mail and then i went to dollar tree i got some stuff for my cats and other things for the house i also went to a grocery store and i got a couple things and uh there's here oh, that's so dark yeah so um yeah i think i'm gonna end the vlog right now i thank you guys so much for watching sorry the lighting is really bad but thank you guys so much for watching um what else that's it i don't really have much to we're gonna smell them close guys drink your water and stay home and don't do shit it started raining when i came so i'm just glad that i'm back it's kind of it's getting colder definitely because you know it's fall so we're getting the fall vibes um 
and that's it once again thank you guys so much for watching thank you so much for rocking with me and i'll see you guys on my next video bye